Hi guys, we are the ESN Corvinus. My name is Anna and I am the event manager, so probably you will see me uh, on most of the events. And today our president Esti is here with me. Hi guys! And in this video we are gonna give you a little tour around the university. Uh, behind my back this is the building E. This is the oldest building out of the three. And uh, let's follow us. Yeah, let's follow us. So don't let me, don't let me, don't let me down I think I'm losing my mind now It's in my head, darling I hope that you'll be here when I need you the most So, the first thing we would like to show you guys on our tour is the yes and office. As you can see, it has the number 7. If you really cannot find it, you can check the recordings at all the time. So, let's have a look inside. So, as I've said, this is our office. Uh, we usually sell tickets and ESN cards here, so you can buy those online now as we wanted to make it more comfortable for you, especially if you are not in Hungary yet. And also, it's a lot safer. Uh, in case the university, as everything else in Hungary, reopens, you can feel free to come inside anytime to ask us about the student life or the university programs. And yeah, if you just miss your home country or feel homesick and need a friend. Yeah, you can see the venue, our mask here. So hopefully you will see a lot of him um, on our events. And he also has a Facebook site. So his name is Benu Corvin. You can check his site all the time and please DM him if you have any questions. So yeah, let's move on, let's check out the great hall. This is the great hall and uh, big parties and sometimes big balls are held in here and uh, if we are move on to that way there is the main corridor and there are four great lecture halls two on behind this wall and two behind that wall Right now we are on the main uh, corridor and behind me this is the bookstore where you can uh, go to print or copy something or buy some books and that way there is a buffet. And right now we are going upstairs to the first floor. This is a brand new study area, so as you can see it's quite modern and beautiful. So you can come here to study or chill a little or just charge your phone or laptop. Now let's check out a few student offices that might be useful during your exchange. Uh, even though you are going to be able to arrange all of your administrative issues online this semester, if you really need to see your study coordinator, who might be Kata, Beata, uh, Bori, or Chris, you can find their offices here, right behind me. The university has three stairways. We came upstairs at the main one, now we are in the southern one, but you can also find one close to the up there at the other entrance. Don't let me down, 
Now let's move on to the other two buildings. Here you can see the Shohas building, which is the smallest one of all three. We are not going to enter that one. Actually, there are too many things inside, mainly just computer labs. You won't really have too many lectures or seminars inside there either. So let's head to the new building, which you can see over there. So this is building C, the newest one of all three. You can find inside some lecture halls as well as seminar rooms, the library and some nice lab spots. Behind us you can also find a cafe, unfortunately it's closed now. But once it reopens I would really recommend visiting it as they have very nice cafe as well as a nice study spot. a really modern club although most of the times it's not very punctual so don't trust it if you are running late for part of your classes just like building E you can find a buffet here as well it's closed now just like everything else and also here you can find some lockers Although this building has a cloakroom as well, if you have to store something during the day while you are in your classes, I would recommend using them. You need a barcode to open and close one. You can use any that you have. But please keep in mind that they reopen themselves at midnight every night, so do not leave anything inside here during the night. Uh, unfortunately, it's closed, so we cannot enter, but uh, hopefully it will reopen soon. And uh, you can come here to study or just use uh, your laptops or computers. the biggest lecture hall in this building and there's a terrace above us so come on and let's check it out Guys, this is the terrace where many students like to enjoy a cigarette in between classes. Uh, we also have a rooftop terrace. Unfortunately, that one is closed most of the time, but we really, really hope that we can organize you a live orientation day as well, as well as a youth group. So, may that be in March, April, or May. We will try to get a permit to show you the beautiful view of the, uh, from the rooftop as well. And this was our tour around the university. We hope you enjoyed it and we hope uh, we can see you soon. Goodbye.